Hello everyone, my name is Jerry VR and welcome to Digimon Cyber Sleep. So it's a game I got for Christmas for the PlayStation 4. Um, I guess I'll look at the options. Uh, yeah, that all looks fine. And it's a game I'm just getting to start playing. What? I don't. I'm not controlling this. So, this is all part of the game. I'm not sure if the game, I mean obviously the texts are showing up in English, um, I'm not sure if that, they'll, the talking, I'm not sure if it's subtitled or if it's actually dubbed. And I don't really have any idea what the actual story is of the game. I just love play. I don't know, I love the Digimon world and everything, so I thought it'd be fun to play. Breakthrough security, steal data, enter password protected forms with ease, do all kinds of nasty things. I had most of the incidents that have been happening. He got his account targeted by them. This is such a weird. Sounds like these burdens of avatars look kind of like monsters. Digimon like digital monsters, exactly. When this happened, just then the VD has logged in. It's a lot to take in really quick. And all in a really stra strange way. Yo, what's up you? Huh? You mean that Eden master? That's Mr. Navit. Sorry, man. So many texts. Yeah, is he a hacker? For real? Speak of the devil. That's right, I'm Mr. Navit, the hacker. Fantastic present for all of you. Be sure to log in to Eden tomorrow. Don't forget now, if you don't log in, I'll hack you. Bye bye now. Mr. Nevin has logged out. What the heck? Was that an actual hacker? No way. I think someone's playing a prank on us. Sounds fun, don't it? Let's check it out. I have no idea how. Like, if these are kids, teenagers, adults. What? I'll tell you. It's just weird to see them in their online avatars. Just a PR for an Eden event, ain't it? A real hacker would be cooler, though. Sounds like I can't stop you. Fine, then. I'll come with. What, is this a date now? You asking me out all of a sudden? Anyway. Anyone else gonna come with us? They're safe and sorry. I'll pass. Me too. I'm in. And so the chatting continued. Akino and Blue Box went on with their late night gab fest. As always, topics were loose with no real focus. Eventually, dawn broke outside their windows. That was the day they were finally going to meet in Eden. They spent the day much as they did the day before. And then the appointed time drew near. All right, so I guess I'll play as male. Oh, forgot to delete everything out. Oh, that's weird. Why, why did it delete that R? 
Is it too long? Okay. Log in with the inner data? Sure. Kamri Shiro Enterprise. Welcome to the Digital Garden of Eden. Eden is a virtual world providing several revolutionary services and new generation of digital content. Maybe since she's reading all the Bountiful entertainment, including shopping and movies. Everyone's needs are met. I will be more than happy to introduce some of the available services that will be a part of your daily life. The future of the net is not behind a screen, it is intuitive virtual reality through the use of avatars. I do hope you enjoy using this cutting edge cyberspace service. Eden is a human network connecting the world to the future, run by Kamishiro Enterprises. Alright, so we're in some virtual reality world. Virtual reality internet. Entrance to Eden. This is where we promised to meet. Came here a little earlier than we'd agreed on. I'm guessing Akino and Blue Box still aren't here. They could be. This will be the first time I've met them outside a chat room. I don't know what their avatars look like though. But I should be able to figure it out. I'll try making small talk with the avatars in the area. Alright, let's get to it. The round thing with the arrows arrow is the access point you can use it to travel around Eden. Okay, so I can't control the camera, can I? No. Huh, what? Alright, so probably not him. I heard there's an area in Eden filled with hackers. Why wouldn't the company shut such a dangerous area down at once? That would make sense, but... Alright, it's too cool to talk. I'm logged in from abroad. It's all thanks to Eden that I can keep up with my buddies. No. Look there. No, don't be obvious. It's a hacker. You shouldn't get too close. Digivices log into Eden and the voice features are handy. Still, maybe my daughter's too young for one. I'm worried about security. I got a cell phone Digivice for my birthday. Yours are those goggles. They're pretty sweet. Next time I'll pick some up. Such a weird. Is his name actually Creepy Hacker? Is his name? That's not suspicious. Are you, my friends? This entrance is one of the largest in all of Eden. It's even a pavilion further in. Have you heard of pavilions? Pavilions are places where companies can safely and securely do business. Unfortunately, there aren't. They aren't open to the public. For any errands at the bank or the post office, the forms can all be taken care of here in Eden. This really is a world of convenience. Is this the Gummy Mon Metal? Okay. Are you my friends? Friends late, I wonder if there was a problem with her access point. Public ones are better but expensive, so she usually logs in from home. Let's see, I guess I'm not their friend. You, my friend? Looking for your friend? If they're not here, did you try looking in the community area? It's an open area just like the entrance, so you can get there from any terminal. There don't seem to be any avatars like them. I guess I showed up too early after all. That's kept hitting the A button, or the X button. 
but there's still time left before our meeting. I should check out some of the other areas. What, just keep talking to people? Even though I'm in the digital world, my avatar looks just like the real me. I know it's supposed to cut down crime, but it still sucks. Nowadays, being able to work at a company's Eden branch is a huge status symbol. I mean, it sounds cool. Can I get behind this? No. So I have a menu. Uh, what did I find? Keyword, player, items. Digimon Metal. A metal from a Gummymon. Avatars move faster than real people. Yeah, probably. Ah, it's fine. It's no more running than gym. It's just an avatar, so it won't affect his muscles. But it'll be good image training now. Hey now, keep running like that, and you're going to fall. Even as an avatar, it'll still hurt. Will it? I don't think it should. Alright. Talk to everyone up there. Talk to a rumor there's a ghost going around Eden. If you ask around, you'll hear stories about the white boy. If you look real close, the facial texture is all messed up. Arms and legs are slimy tentacles. The real form is the demon of the creeping darkness. He comes up to your avatar and snaps it up, chomp chomp. That's a rumor anyway. That's just, what? I, how did that rumor get started? What now? Okay. Oh, I didn't. I skipped this level, didn't I? Oh wait, no. I talked to those two. Now I need to talk to these people. Today I'm logging in from a top class salon in Brotbungi. Both the service and the avatar management are first rate. I've been to Shunjuku and Shibuya's Eden spots. The login areas and the cafes were packed. And what's more, filthy. I deserve better. Oh shoot, I'm not supposed to be at this pavilion today messed up the URL again. And you can use access points to get to areas of protections that are always live. To go to any place else, you'll need the URL. Alright, I talked to everyone. Is there another area? Sure. Don't know what that means. Use directional buttons to choose a destination. If there are new areas that you can go to, they will be indicated that it's new. Selecting log off will return you to the point you use to access Eden. Good. Okay. So we're in the Eden community. This is the community area. I like this place, it's quiet and relaxed. Digivice's talk features getting a call. Who could it be? Huh? Hey there, it's me, Mr. Navit. Just one sec, you're behind schedule, silly. You're gonna be late. Hurry up, come to Galacta Park in Kowloon. Your friends arrived a little while ago and they're waiting for you. I have a gift for all of you, but everyone has to be there first. Bye bye. Kowloon, isn't that the dangerous area full of hackers? I don't know. Anyway, the others are waiting for me. I'd better hurry to Galacta Park. I've never even ever even been anywhere near Cologne. How do I get there? So now I have to ask these people how to get there. There might be someone here who knows how to get to Galacta Park. We got a keyword, Galacta Park, Cologne. During conversations, you'll hear keywords. The keywords you hear will be marked with a lock icon, which means you can ask a character about that keyword. If you ask about the right keywords, the lock will open and you'll learn new information. Okay. So will the lock just appear naturally? Another 
metal. Busy here. First keyword to, to remember from Mr. Nabbit. Kaloon, you're around. Uh, what? You want to go to Kaloon? But why? It's lawless and filled with hackers. Besides, that's what you're into. We're done here. Go talk to a hacker if you want to know about it. There's a hacker looking thug near the entrance. Don't blame me for your foolish decisions. Grow up and take responsibility. I can't even talk to that person. We're not going to talk to everyone because that would just take way too much time. So it wants me to go back to the entrance now and talk to that other hacker. Or the person who obviously looked like a hacker. It's a good thing these load times are quick. Galactic Park Cologne. I want to go to Galactic Park. That's what you think you want, isn't it? I'll show you the way. This is the URL to their area. Take it. Got the URL. Now I can go to Kalu. Not gonna say anything. That's the whole area. This area is huge. Okay, maybe it's not the whole area. This is just the transition, isn't it? You know, why was that kid running if you can fly? <laughs> Where did everybody go? Got to be kidding me. No, you're late. So late. Okay. So it is just subtitled, not dubbed. Let's see. Sorry I'm late. I'm Yegaber. I go by. Aiba? Oh, hey, yep. Yeah. I'm Akino. It's your first time in Eden, right? My real name's Nokia Shiramini. Mina? Hello, nice to meet you. I'm gonna butcher all of these names. Not. You're late. What are you. What were you doing? Leave me all those dangerous place. How would you feel if you were in my shoes? Did I see a blue box has shown up yet? Oh, he showed up alright, but what does that even matter? Can you believe this? He's all, oh, I've got to go and find a ghost, and all of a sudden he's running off by himself. That's how he rolls, apparently. 100% fool of himself. Thinks he's all that just because he's got good looks or whatever. So like what, the ghost of the pale boy? Heard the rumors, but don't know the details. What does he even plan to do if he finds it? Ghost in cyberspace? That's unscientific. Doesn't even make any sense. Not that I'm scared or nothing. Ooh. Eek! Whoa, easy overreacting a bit there, aren't we? Jeez, Arata. It's just you. I, th I thought you were a ghost. Sheesh, you don't have to act all tough by coming to a place like this if you're a chicken, you know. Hey now, you're the one who ditched me in that place like this. You slimy little no good. Just shut your trap. Anyhow. We've never met before here before, have we? I'm a rather Sanada. Nice to meet you and all that. Hey now, that's no proper introduction. You must have put two and two together by now. This is the person behind Blue Box. 
is not what you imagined, is it? The chat is kind and considerate, like a reliable big brother figure, right? When I first met him, I was really weirded out. He's surly, self-absorbed, he's got this weird look in his eye. Talk about a waste of good looks, am I right? Leave the stupidity for later, okay? So I was waiting for Yeriver. I took a little look around. I thought that Mr. Navit fellow who called us here might be around. What? I thought you were looking for a ghost. I was doing a little of that too. But in the end, I found neither. Or there wasn't anyone around to be found. There could be one or two hackers in an area like Galoon, no matter how dangerous it is. So very sorry to keep you waiting. I'm Mr. Navit. I've got something for all you good boys and girls who showed up here today. This is a miraculous power to change the world. When's this gonna Digimon? Huh? What, what is this? It's attacking. We've all been hacked. Who would have thought? You follow a hacker into the hacker's world and you get hacked. A new program has been installed, Digimon Capture. Oh, this Mr. Nevit fellow is no slash. He broke through my firewall like it was nothing. Digimon Capture? That was English. I mean, it's, a name, but it's a hacking tool that's been making the rounds for hackers lately. Wait, so when you say Digimon, you like you mean like Digimon Digimon. Yes, those Digimon. The ones you're so interested in. Hmm. Hmm. Certain kind of data known as digital monsters can be captured by scanning this thing. Uh, wow. It's weird, a world where Digimon are real but barely known. Oh, hey, I mean, uh, Digimon are like nasty programs and hackers, use, right? And so that, so then, so then, it means if we become hackers. Just Think she's a hacker. Hackers are nothing out of the ordinary nowadays. No way. No. -uh. No. -uh. Hackers are bad news. I'm not doing this. I don't want any part of this. I'm gonna delete this program. No way. You gotta be kidding me. You can't uninstall this thing. The program's protected. Who knows what will happen if you force delete it? What do you mean? Could that, could that be the ghost everyone's talking about? So that was Mr. Navit. I don't think either of those are the right thing, but don't let him get away. Hold up, why are we chasing him? Right, I'm out of here, I'm going home, you hear? What is this? It wasn't here before. What's it doing here? Did some hacker do this? Is this telling us to keep going onward? Are they not letting us go back home? Well, we can hack now, so can we hack the wall? Uh... Arata could be in trouble, let's go after him. I guess. No, I'm not going, I won't. Alright. That's fine. Triangle while on the field to activate the Digibush and save almost any time. Make sure you save frequently so you don't regret. Okay. I feel like that's a good time to save. Let's cross save. Oh, I don't need I don't need to do that. So she's still here. I don't know why I thought that soccer ball would have real physics. If I could kick it or something. Nope. Alright. Onward. Does the Kaloon area stretch all the way back through here? It feels totally different from the cyberspace areas in the upper part of the Eden network. There's no trace of Arata. We may have gone further inside. 
should be careful. So what if, if this area is known for hackers and that company lets it exist, does it probably mean that they're benefiting off of this area of the world somehow? Ghosts or errata something. And I'm going down. It's the glitchy kid. Blank has been inscribed. Something. What was that? Includes as dangerous as they say. Who knows what might happen here? I better hurry up, find Arada, and get out of here. Okay, let's do those things. Who's this? What's wrong? You look like you've seen a ghost. You saw a ghost that looked like me? Not what you should tell people. That's true, that ghost may have been me. Some call me the Wraith of Eden. They say I'm not of this world. The truth is simply that I'm, I'm rather elusive and tend to turn up unexpectedly, that's all. Please relax, I'm not a ghost. I'm very real here, Nathan. I exist to guide those who are lost, like you. We just had a program installed, Digimon ha Capture, which marks you as a hacker. You're still merely a fledgling hacker. There are hackers with a wide variety of different goals here in Eden. Chivalrous ones who find and report security holes, thieves who steal accounts to rob money and data, others are just out to prove their skills. Truly a wide variety. What kind of hacker do you want to be? Can I get the choice? Indeed, a fledgling, if that is your only response. Not even hatched from your idea. Free to become a hacker if you want, or something else altogether. It's up to you. What led you to this is neither here nor there. You came here because you're interested in hacking, and now because of that, you got to get you on capture for yes. I don't like that he's just constantly beckoning me towards him. I therefore recommend you giving the remarkable power of these Digimon programs a try. That's fine. Now, to commemorate your birth as a fellow hacker to be, I present you with your first Digimon. There behind you is a Digimon program. Uh, okay. I'm guessing just one of them. There are three different types of Digimon here. Let's see. Excessively adorable animal, possibly fragrant plant, and mechanical looking machine type. Well, because it's what? Hagurumon, Palmon, and like Togumon? Uh, I think I like Palmon the best out of the three. Because I want to see what um, what's what is it? Terrier Mon. That's right. And yeah, Guru Mon. Virus Electric. So we'll go Palmon. You seem to have made up your mind. 
Okay, let's bring you out of your shell. Several steps are required to obtain a Digimon. If you discover or encounter a Digimon program, run a scan and acquire the analyzed data. Those are all done with Digimon capture. You can use that without any restrictions. Just because you got the analyzed data doesn't mean the Digimon program itself is yours. First, you must convert it. You have to launch the Digimon program and implement it in cyberspace first and foremost. Only then can it serve as digital monster, a hacking program that is, is not to be trifled with. Unlike Scan, however, Convert is not part of the Digimon Capture application. Hackers finally devised the technique needed. Certain rules were put in place regarding how it's used. This all sounds ridiculous. Con and considering what it is, it's still ridiculous. In order to control how this power is exercised, your chosen Digimon program is still weak, but it will grow in power and Digivolve. As you gain experience, your programs will become more powerful as well. Someday, immense power might be yours. When that day comes, responsibility will come along with it. Hackers may be free spirits, but they must never succumb to chaos. Never that. What if I want chaos? Nothing wrong with chaos. I'm sure most of this went over your head, but tuck it away in a corner of your mind. Besides, merely having Digimon capture gives you hacker status. It's a special program, but a hacker's ability, values, and goals can all be seen in how well that hacker can use Digimon programs. Just protecting the Order of Eden is a hacker's first duty. I'd be very happy if you would try to become that kind of hacker. But I want to be the Chaos Hacker. After all, hackers have been with Eden since its inception. You want the Digimon right now? I see. You've heard what I have to say and decide you want to become a proud hacker too. No! I want to make chaos. Well, follow the steps, start with the scan, have Digimon capture running, and target a... Huh? Jeez. The Digimon I've prepared for you went and ran away. Plenty of other Digimon will find another. Wait just a minute. It did surprise me, though. For a Digimon as tough as that one to appear in this area, it could have been released as a bad joke by a low level hacker. Or is it an attack on me by someone else? Is that you want to go after it? You want a powerful Digimon like that? No, you couldn't handle it. Forget about it. that you're concerned about the Digimon being chased. You are a curious one still. That's all the more reason to leave with me. You'd look foolish if you got hurt interfering in a fight between two mere programs. I have to go help. If that's what you want, then you should do it. Chase after it. That's your decision. Yeah, I want my Palmon. Okay, instantly into a cutscene. If I picked Terriermon, this would be like the Digimon movie. Oh boy, you really are new at this. Do you intend to face off against the digital monster unarmed? You truly are curious. No, you're just a soft touch, that's it. More coincidence, I have both of those things as well. Just this once allowed me to age. Up. You have a Digimon I can use? You don't need to do anything for the moment. Watch and learn this is how a real hacker uses their skills. Well, it seems it wants to fight with you. May have been something in, of an ordeal, but that Digimon is now yours. Struck it well and mastered the program. Okay, 
Enemy and ally stats are displayed on the timeline during battle. Uh, so enemy stats are on the Digimon timeline. Okay, ally stats. Digimon move in order from the top. Allies are blue, enemies are red, and guests are green. The command has selected the predicted post action positions displayed. Issue commands to your allies to proceed with the battle. Attack with the X button. Further commands to hold down the directional button. Or the left stick while pressing the X. Escape by holding down the R1 and pressing the X. Press the options button to let your Digimon act on their own. Attack is regular, skill is skill, guard is defend, item, change, switch out battling party with backup. Okay. Auto battle and escape. Alright, so we're going. I don't have any skills, do I? Physic. Okay. Poison Ivy. Physical attack, 65 plant damage to one foe. 10% chance of poison. Or my regular. It's about the same. Get the kill before it even gets to attack. I should have guarded. Just make it attack. Alright, we leveled up. And we get Crescent Leaf as a skill. It's very rare to obtain a Digimon without scanning it through Digimon Capture. It's more for a program to like a person. Yeah, that's true. Everything about this is odd. You'll probably be an irregular element among the anyway, You're free from your shell now. The rest is up to you. I shall take my leave. Young male with a nasty look in his eyes. Ah, the other irregular one. Who's headed to that area over there? Did that break down the firewall now? It used to be the old Eden entrance, the remains of Eden's creation. It's forgotten dregs. Proof of that lies in the fact that an original logout zone remains there. It's lock protecting can't be used, but a, a hacker could probably deal with said lock. Yes, if you want to leave this place, it would be a good idea to use that on that zone. That boy should be able to unlock it in a snap, as long as his skills haven't waned, that is. Why are you surprised? Don't tell me he hasn't told you. He's already a hacker? In that case, it's not my story to tell. It's better to hear it directly from him. That's right, I haven't introduced myself. I am Yugo. Yugo from Team Zaxxon. If you want to become a top tier hacker, then you should see this out. The doors are always open to you. No sense thinking of conspiracy theories. Anyway, Arata was headed to that area over there. I mean, there's supposed to be an old logout zone there, and we might be able to log out. I'll go get Nokia. Alright. There are two types of skills. Special moves and inherited skills. Special moves... Inherited skills attained from the start. Details of these moves change after each time a Digimon digivolves or de-digivolves. Inherited skills after digivolving or de-digivolve. You can use a skill you once learned by leveling up. Okay. Digimon can have up to 20 different skills. It exceeds 20, skills must be deleted. And you can set up to 6 special moves or skills. Okay. So I have to go get this girl. Alright, another cutscene. I'm going to continue snacking on gummy bears, because I can. 
Where did those two go? Like, like, could the hackers have maybe what, deleted them? Quickly. Hey, wait. She get. She get Agumon or. Not remembering these names is gonna kill me. <laughs> Gob Gobumon. <laughs> ah, ah. What, what, what are you? Um, who are you? How can they talk? It, it can talk. It's so, so, so adorable. My name's Nokia. What's your names? Me? My name is Agumon. I, I'm Gabumon. Agumon and Gabumon. <laughs> what weird names. Hey, they're not weird. You're the one with the weird name. As if. My name's not weird. <laughs> huh? Wait. Okay, yeah. Huh? What's wrong? Have my totes, adorbs, good looks stunned you speechless? It smells so something familiar. Wait, what? Me? Yeah, familiar and reassuring. What? Oh, that's kind of embarrassing. Sorry, I guess my naturally alluring pheromones are worth the force today. Ah, see, you are weird. This game's ridiculous. Yagabunar, where the heck have you been? It's, it's another scary person. I'm sick of being chased around. Run right away. Well, come down, this is a friend of mine. Shucks, they're gone. So what were those cute little critters? Never mind, who's that with you? This huh? That, that's a Digimon? And those little cuties were Digimon too? But those Digimon in this one here don't seem like bad Pokemons. Digimon, huh? Any cute critters like them around could be pretty okay. Maybe this Digimon capture thing won't be so bad after all. What? There's a violent wild Digimon too. Whatever was sounds super duper scary. She just comes around to liking Digimon and he tells her there's a scary virus one. Arata's in the area through there. I'll go with you. Let's go find him ASAP. Now, where the... I've just... Okay, so this is the beginning area. Right. So we... Okay, we do have random encounters. The date of Digimon calendar in battles is automatically scanned and saved. Digimon with 100% or higher scan rate can be materialized in Digilab later and made into allies. Okay. So. Okay, so that uses less SP. But attacking is still just about as strong. So, grow, growing up, two of my let's see, my favorite Digimon games were like Digimon World Two and Digimon World One. In that order, all kind of Digimon left in dungeons. Playing Digimon while moving will trigger a battle. So be sure to pay attention to that. Um, yeah, because did they were both Digimon World Two was. Kinda like this, except temple crawling. Digimon World 3 is probably the most like this. I wonder what those different colored bars are. Oh, but I get to attack twice. Okay, so he's poisoned. He's just straight up dead. I should have killed him. So we got another attack. Now I know 
poison goes at the end of their turns. So what's in here? Treasure chest? Alright, three HP capsules. Alright. So what is this way? Alpars. Alright, so now we have 100% for Koromon. Coromon scan complete. So I can get a one of him. I can get a Coromon sunshine. How much do these heal? 250. So I don't quite need one. <clears throat> I want to see if when I level up I get my health and S my health fully restored. Two more HP capsules. Okay, two different ones. Habumon and Poyomon. Doesn't matter the order. How do you miss? Or why do you miss? So after I get out of here, I'll probably just be able to spawn all these baby Pokemon. But then I can have all the starter or Digidestin Pokemon, so that'll be nice. So I'll just keep... so I don't know if I'm supposed to go here or to that area like behind me. Oh, now I've overscanned them. What's that even mean? I wanted to use an SP. Well, if, the, if my HP recovers, my SP should recover too. What does settings do? Okay, nothing. Well. Nothing of value it needs this time. Alright. Okay, because he's standing in front of that gate. Palamon? Yeah, she got healed. Another basic attack. I'm sure there's. Oh, wait, this isn't our friend. You aren't worthy of going any further. Once you've proven your strength and pride as a hacker, the pack will open on its own. Well, okay. I'm curious if Palmon will digivolve at the same kind of levels as, like, Digimon World 2 is the only one I've played enough to know in depth, but... So if at level 10 or, or level 11, if he'll evolve champion level. This is the way I'm supposed to go. <gasps> Something feels really strange. This all happened before when I was a kid. When I was a kid. It's like I've met you in Arata before. Yeah, I feel the same way. That's a stupid thing to say. No, not like we had met yesterday in chat or anything like that. Like maybe, yeah, maybe. Something strange. <laughs> what 
What was that? Did, did you see it? Oh, I, you both did see it. Again, with the hacking, honestly, what is with this place? Let's go, Arata should be up ahead, right? And see this ghost kid just hanging out over here. Who was that image just now? A child? I'm so weirded out. Darn it. I want to know what that was. Whoa. This doesn't feel not... This does not feel right. Ah, there it is. There. Hang on, hey, you've run off by yourself? You can't just think about yourself, you know. Did he get a Digimon? Because I'm... Gonna be surprised if I'm the only one that got one right now. What is that? Why? Why is there a giant squid tentacle monster? Oh, Japan. What? What is this? Is that, is that another Digimon? It can't be. The Black Monster of Eden. You know what I'm talking about? Okay. It says it devours your data. Guys, this way. Run. Whatever this thing is, it's a real mess, that's for sure. I'll break through the lock on this thing. Log out and get away as fast as you can. Hey, I told you to run, didn't I? Go on, get out of here. Uh, well, um, hey. I like that I ran. And... Okay. I was gonna say, is she gonna get attacked by the tentacle monster? Because that's too much. Hey, it's you guys again. We'll protect you, Nokia. Nokia, get, get out of here. Ah. They get uh, data is converging. Attack up, intelligence down. First flame and heavy strike. Yeah, guys, those didn't do any damage. Oh, oh, I thought I hit the. Guys, we're not we're not doing any any damage. That chance of inflicting poison. Yeah, because if I poison him, erode terminal. Yeah. What should we do? It's too strong. Alright, why am I so weak? You have to help Nokia and the others. Okay, lock is taken care of. You can log out. Come on, Nokia, hurry. But what about them? Did you get it? You're holding them back. You can't do anything until you get away. Huh? Yeah, that doesn't make any sense to me either, Nokia. You're not alone in this confusion. Nerva, Nokia's logged out. I'll go next. You hurry on after us, okay? What a dick. I mean, he did open the portal, the log out. Am I gonna make it? What kind of world is this virtual world where you need a spot to log out? Find us. Digivice warning. Unexpected error occurred during the logout process of Yegerber Aiba. Logout process cannot continue. The logout process cannot continue. Okay. Um, logout progress will continue. Oh. Logout successful. Let's use your next login. Eden is a human network connecting the world to the future by run by Kamishiro Enterprises. Kamishiro. Where the fuck 
fuck am I? What? Um, excuse me. Isn't that dangerous? What's up with that kid? Yikes. What? You there. What's with making such a scene in broad daylight? Don't need to arrest you, do you? Um, officer over here. Who are you calling a police officer? I'm a detective. Don't judge a book by its cover. I'll arrest you. What the? What is that? What's going on? Oh, that's gross. So gross, I'm gonna arrest you. Right here on the spot. Jeez, lady, I can't help. Who? Why would you arrest? <laughs> I mean, yeah. Just sitting in the street seems like something you can arrest someone for. Not for being, being gross. With an interesting appearance. I'm very curious. And what before it gets to way worse. Stop that car, arrest you. Wait, ah. I got heavily animated. The outside is I'm more used to strange phenomena than those. I've never seen the likes of this before. Can you hear my voice? Are you able to speak? That's good. I wasn't sure what I was going to do if you weren't human. <laughs> so you have no idea what it is that happens to you. How? If you have any questions, ask them now. I'll answer whatever I can. How? How does this happen to a person? And how am I the first person that this has happened to? I guess where is this place? Here in Shinjuku. I was out working looking for something when I came across you. Here. I may not believe that, but that's the truth. Head of my agency office in Nakano. Tell me the details when we get there. Can I ask it again? Okay. I thought she'd have a different response. For some reason. What? I don't know where I would where my character lives. So. It looks like your body is in an extreme digital state, as if it were a cyberspace avatar, yet somehow here in the real world. That's true, this is a very interesting phenomenon. She's, she won't know where my friends have gone. No, there wasn't anyone else around. I guess that's important to know. You're wondering whether the same thing might have happened to your friends? I see. I can't tell you not to worry about them. The first priority should be taking care of yourself. Who are you? Who am I? Oh, I should have done that earlier. There's such curiosity completely slipped my mind. I'm Kyoko Korean. I'm just a humble detective. Save? Sure. Because if. It's gonna take me here. Oh wow, I've been playing for an hour. Nope, it should be good. Look on all Broadway. Welcome to the Karimi Detective Agency. Ooh, and trophy earned? What's that say? Reach chapter one. This is a digital boy sitting on the couch. You oh. see, you're not a good grasp. You see, you've got a good grasp on the situation. That place in Shinjuku, the one where you appear when you log out from Cyberspace. It's the same or very similar to the place you logged into Eden at, isn't it? No. Hmm. When you're here talking to me now, it seems there's another body out there for you as well. Yeah, that's the one I want. Maybe your mental data was separated from your physical body, manifest in the real world. 
Maybe your body was somehow moved to Shinjuku, but was corrupted into the form you have now. The whole situation is entirely too peculiar. But here you are, standing before me, as much as that shouldn't make sense. At present, I can only form a simple hypothesis. We need to gather more information quickly. Going by the book, you should check out where you logged into Eden, which is where. Uh, why are you helping me here? This isn't some part of some wicked scheme, is it? I mean, I. Why are you helping me? Hmm, where are you now? You're at the Kurumi Detective Agency. I saw a number of rather bizarre cases. I wouldn't ask either question, really, but I think of nobody better suited to solving the mystery of what happens if you've been right here. And you're even sitting on the sofa for clients. I would... I don't know. I would want to know what the hell is happening with this person if I saw them in real life. No need to worry about compensation. The very existence is all the payment I need. Let's pretend you boarded a luxury liner and say Mary Celeste. Anyway, let's get back on track here. Where did you log in? First, before we do anything else, we must do something about your appearance. You can't even walk around outside like that. It looks pretty unstable as well. Had a good look, and you're truly a mass of data, a true digital body. When you hear my voice, sit on my sofa, talk to me, it's proof that you obey physical laws. Digital body, real world characters. It's called a half cyber body, hehe. <laughs> your body is comprised of data, and it could be easy to do something about your appearance. Incorporate compatible data and make repairs. You share the same basic structure as an avatar used within the Eden. Excellent if there were avatar parts in the data found lying around. Parts of the data found lying around in Kaloon. The only issue is whether or not you can log in in your current state. I can try. Because that's the good part of the Digimon games, probably. What is it? Did something happen with the television? Over here, jump. Just jump and break the TV. Jump? Couldn't possibly. Jump! Yeah, that's that's normal. Who has who doesn't just Yeah, this is fine. Urged on by the voice, I took a leap of faith. What the heck happened? Looks like I can go forward after all. This is a digital space where the information flow becomes visual due to the, the protagonist's cyber body. Choose your direction with directional buttons for the stick. Bow may be initiated, so always be on guard when moving. Alright. Just need to check on something real quick, so I will be right back. Alright, I'm back, and Palmon's still a little damaged, let's, I guess it doesn't really matter which way I go. Alright, ooh, different baby Pokemon. Curious how long I'm just gonna battle 
baby ones. We're just going straight left the whole way. This way, if there is anything in any of these, we'll, we'll find our. We'll find whatever, whatever there is. Ooh, 1.5 multiplier. For some reason. Okay. And new area. Log out. I guess. Guess I can't go back the way I came. Is this Eden? I mean, it looks like Eden. This is Kyoko Karemi. Can you hear me? I nearly lost you, but I managed to get a trace. What the heck happened? I think you were sucked into the terminal and just disappeared. Basically. See, I'm guessing you passed through the actual network lines themselves. The office terminal is connected to Eden's network. You rode the flow within the wires as data and appeared in Eden. Makes sense. So then for you, the network appears as an actual series of roads. It's still it's shocking to see you made such a direct transition from the real world to the digital one. Yeah. To submerge into the digital world just by touching it the terminal, a dive, no jump. From now on, I'm going to call that ability of yours a connection jump. What a happy little unexpected accident. Now you can go look around for Avatar Park data. Head to Kulun. There's plenty of junk data lying around in Kulun. Should be easy to find what you need. Alright, let's talk to people and freak them out. The hacker worth his salt doesn't take a normal status as lightning. Oh, as you can see a dagger. They might wear off with time, but you'll be at a disadvantage if you leave them. Ah, what? What's wrong with you? No, no, no. You don't have to say it. You got your avatar and abnormal status, eh? Experienced hacker like me knows all about it, so let me give you this valuable of advice. Go to the admins and get that fix. You never want to run low on items. Export your home game. Whoa, what's wrong with your avatar? You should tell the admins. How in the world did you end up looking like this? Some sort of error or a hack? Such a thing as having too many recovery items. That's just hacker common knowledge. I always have an extra record. Fuck, why am I doing I'm talking to a noob like you? I hope nobody saw me. Don't want to get lost. You didn't even look at me. See how ugly I was. This place is supposed to be for members only. How did you get in here without a pass? Your avatar is really weird. Are you some kind of rookie hacker? Well, why would. Why do people assume I'm a rookie? I would think that's really cool. How'd you get in here? I know I locked the room. Is this a bug? Who are you supposed to be? You remember this chat room? I've never seen that avatar before. Alright, just take me out of this boring chat room. This way, come on. I should go in the direction of that voice. Which was to Kaloon? Like a cat over there? Oh, it is a cat. How do you have a cat in. I guess you could have a cat in VR. Ah, so you can hear my voice. Welcome to the Digital Lab. This place has a faint connection with the digital world. Uh, paradise for Digimon. I am Miri Mikagura. I open this paradise unto you. Digi Lab? Uh, Digital Monsters Lab. You could call it DML for short, I suppose. I recommend calling it the Digi Lab, though. Digital World? It's okay if you don't know about it. For now, at least. When the time comes, I expect you will know what you need to know. I called you. No, that's not quite it. 
It was you who called me. You're beginning to develop a deep connection with Digimon. Strings of fate intertwined and drew me in, and so I found you. In other words, it was you who called out to me. But that's enough of that for now. So what kind of place is this? Go and check it out with your own eyes. Alright, you can organize your party, Digivolve, D-Digivolve, feed your Digimon, train them, take on dungeons you've cleared, purchase items from the farm, network battle, recover HP and SP. Okay, Digibank. Scan rates maxed out 200, and the higher the scan rate, the higher the abilities Digimon receive when created. Okay. So let's. What are the stats? I don't know. Let's. Con I'm just gonna convert the two of them because I feel like it's a good thing to have some, like a couple on my team to start off. Coromon. Alright, we got Coromon. Right. Uh... Right. Can I move Digimon, party Digimon, and take up to 11 with me? Press the store Digimon or farm. One up. Alright, so Digifarm is used to raise Digimon. Digivice needed to take along Digimon has its own capacity. It's called the party memory. Just keep your party Digimon's memory use below this value. Okay. Just memory up to increase your party. Alright, so. Can I, can I bring him with me? Okay. Okay, so I'm using 10 and I have 20. Can I train? That's a little bit of training. Is this training? Digiform. Digimon kept a Digiform will gain experience. Giving instructions will result in various effects. Okay. How do how does one train Digimon? What's this? Mirror dungeon. That's the mirror dungeons like we do them. Coliseum. Digibattles online with players around the country. You cannot battle if your party memory is more than 150. Jesus. Alright, so I can't do that. So, what's this one? Terminal, welcome. Oh, it's the store. Yeah, I can't afford any of these things. So, so I can't train them directly. Oh yeah. Digivolving returns to Digimon to level one, but raises their max level and abilities. It's more than one Digivolution route, and Digimon can Digivolve into various forms, written in guides depending on the conditions met. There are also Digimon you can get by fusing two together. Um, Digivolving will make them weaker, but will increase their max level and abilities. Abilities affect not only the conditions for Digivolving, but the max values. Okay. So if I... How to Digivolve? Okay. So, I need level 16 or higher and cam 25%. 14, 12. Okay. So, what does it take to get Agumon? Level 9. Uh, Garamon. Toy Agumon. Just need to train with him a bit. Alright. So, how do I. I guess I, I'm thinking. I guess I'll save and then leave. Right. 
Understand Digilab? Use it carefully to further your interaction with Digimon. Let me see if you're the person I thought you might be. Finally, one last thing. A small token for you. You've got a hacking skill. Hacking skills shine in com combination with Digimon use, but are dangerous if used for unscrupulous hacking purposes. Now you use your s how you use your skills is up to you. Never forget that. You deepen your special ties with Digimon. Live with them, share their joys and sadnesses, and grow together. By deepening your bond with the Digimon, they'll surely offer you their aid. It's a very important ability that it will even change your life. Connection jump, that's what you call your curious skill. I know nothing of this power. It's like a hacking skill, but a little different. But I'm certain it's a skill that will serve you in unique ways. I'll see you later. Take care. When on the field, press the square to bring up the hacking menu. Use various abilities to use the skill. As you move part of your must meet necessary conditions. Check the condition of your skill for the player menu of your digivice. You are heading to Kaloon, I suspect. Just this once, I'll let you use the special exit. Next time, go to the access point if you please. What's the special exit? Location devices that use the flow of the digital web. Reference points for digital network that connect to locations everywhere. Half cyber protagonist can use connection jump to move from here to Eden or the digi digi lab. Okay, so in the real world, they're yellow phone booths. In Eden, they're the blue floaty things. Okay, whatever. I don't. At least level one firewall. Right. Analyze and unlock. And unlocks encrypted data. Increases encounters. Alright, well apparently I can't do any of these. Maybe Digimon don't spawn in this little um, entrance exit area. Alright, so we hacking skill, wall crack, you limit secure firewalls that block your way. The skill has different levels depending on the resilience of the firewall and won't be able to take down a firewall if your skill isn't high enough. Yep, that's how hacking works. Ah, I was not close enough. Okay, so I'm back. Oh, this that was the the first one. It's me. Whew, I finally got through to you. Lost your trace info and had to search again. Where'd you wander off to this time? No, I see. So you ran into Marie Kagura. Yeah, you could say we've acquaint were acquainted. Regardless, for there to have been a natural progression where you would meet her, you seem to have the craziest luck. Let's assume you carried out your original objective. We'll start by. What? You've already broken through the firewall. Well done. You saved me some time. Hee <laughs> hee. All right, on to our next move. Scan the area around the entrance to Kaloon and mark key junk data sites. Junk data will serve as your body parts. You will need to go find and retrieve some. Something of a stopgap measure, and it may not be a perfect solution, but I'm sure your skills are up to the task. It's a key step to returning your body to normal, so buck up and get to work. It's okay. Searching for body parts isn't as hard as defeating 48 demons now, is it? Think of it as an emergency measure. I look forward to meeting you in your normal body. She's hitting on me. It's a tool of communication with people who aren't in the same place. You receive messages from your friends in Digimon. Notification appears in the bottom right of your screen. Click touchpad. I forgot I have a touchpad. Or check your receive message from the Digiline menu of your Digivice. You should also reply to your messages when you receive one that needs a reply. Shaking farm trees makes fruit fall. I love them, but I can't take too much. Hey, you went to KKF and didn't bring me some mayo? Don't you forget next time. Those are weird things. Did I surprise you? But that's what Digiline is all about, you know? Let's try using simple phrases you learn from clients. Let's try using simple phrases you learn. Did you want to find will be excited if you respond to their... Please throw left to reply. Got it. Okay. I, I guess I 
replied well enough. I don't know. Part of my body. Part of my... Is it guarded or did I just happen to run into something? Scan data of new Digimon will be collected. Digimon will be registered with Field Guide. At the Digilab, you can digiconvert and browse by making friends with Digimon through Digivolution Digi... Yeah, I, I, I got that. Let's see, they attack at the same time. Well, one after the other. Uh, let's guard. Just in case. Whew. Until they get a couple levels, we'll keep them guarding. And I got an avatar point. I expected to partially become visible. Alright, let's see, is there anything over here? Yes. Alright, so attack. I should have attacked the other one. Guard, guard, attack. Alright, so they leveled up. Oh, everyone leveled up. Good. Oh, shoot. These are all types of ability attributes, each with their own affinity. There are four attributes, virus, vaccine, dead, and free. Attacks from a type with good affinity and with double damage. Okay, so viruses hurt data, data beats vaccine, vaccine beats viruses. Okay, so I'm good against vaccine, which, oh. Attacks with good attributes and with one and a half normal damage. Attacks using skills reflect the attribute of said skill. What? All I know is Palmon is going to be do double damage against Biomon, right? Or one and a half. Okay, double. Do they have any skills? 30 damage, 90% accuracy. Okay. Well, it's water, so it should be good against Gatsumon. It was not. Magic 30 water damage to one fell. I want skill. Guard. Oh, here. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. They should be able to survive pretty well with guarding. Oh, and I'm doing most of the attacks for all of those attacks are mine. Alright, Koromon leveled up again and Pabamon leveled up. I like that those things tell you what the requirements are for all the different evolution digivolutions. Otherwise, I would just be doing this at random and hoping to get here. What? A... what? But I, I can, I can half level one buffer walls. Barely survive. Why is everyone attacking Pabumon? 
Like, spread out the hate. What? No idea what happened. Oh, I got a message. Is it about whatever just happened? Let's just quickly climb and press. Um, got it. Guess you should get a reply to a reply sometimes. So I'll probably just finish up this area, um, get all these avatar parts, and then probably end the stream. Oh wow, he's, he's fast. He gets the first two attacks. And normal statuses, allies and enemies can suffer from statuses, um, unique effects just draining HP or altering stats. Ends return, paralyze, confusion ends return, paralyze ends sleep, and stun. No self healing from poison, dot, bug. Okay, set ups are red, and set down are blue. I'm sure it's all pretty intuitive and in like most games that an avatar play. I can only take three Digimon into a battle with me, right? Nope, I don't need the hack right here. Right? Okay, and then eight on your server. I'm guessing only the ones that battle would get any experience. So after these three, I'd want to keep the rest in the farm. There's nothing over that way. Export. What are some of these items? Uh, escape gate, escape from battle. Instantly return party to the dungeon entrance. Alright, avatar parts. I, wouldn't, I really wish I knew what these medals did. I'm assuming they'll come into play with the game eventually, but. Alright. Cross combat. A cross combo can occur when two or more allies are lined up on the timeline. Cross combo's power up attacks and skill effects with the help of allied digit. Cross combo effects are split into the following four types chain attack, number of hits, damage up, heal up, or skill up. Occurrence rates are displayed on the timeline. Each closes you attacking Digimon with high camaraderie will have a higher rate. Okay, so is there a percent somewhere of this chance of this attack. I don't see anything. Okay. I'm starting to one hit kill the other egg Pokemon or Digimon with mine with my own egg Digimon. Another avatar part, and was it the last one? Hmm, if you at least look normal again, it's not a perfect solution, but it's a big step. Rejected has, has been set met, come back to the agency. What's that? You don't know how to get back? Hmm, try logging out like you always do. But you went in through an agency terminal, my guess is that you should come out through one. 
To be honest, in your case, I don't know what, what will happen until we try. Worst case, if your data gets scattered throughout the network, I'll savage as much as I can. <laughs> I'm joking. Sort of. Okay. We'll just head into the exit. No last minute fights. Well, the zone is still broken. Guess whatever Arata did was temporary. Okay, so we do. We do have to run the back. Run our way out of here. Which is good, because that will give me a chance to... Chance to battle some more. Pokemon can be another one of them can be created, converted. Let's see. Am I gonna trigger a cutscene somewhere in here? got a new skill. Let's see. Is this path? That path's still closed off up there, so we're heading back to this entrance. Alright. Surprisingly no problems there. I don't think any Digimon spawn in this area, so I guess I could have used that escape, but I'll save that for later. Uh, yeah, we'll go. No, because I want to log out. How does one do such a thing? Right. Oh wait, yeah, this go to another area will log me out. I forgot that it's right here. Let's see where we log out to. Hey, the detective agency. <laughs> you made it back in one piece, didn't you? I wouldn't have expected anything different. Still, those abilities border on the unreal. Maybe the reason you still adhere to physical laws has to do with instinctual fear present in all physical organisms. <laughs> this is all truly fascinating. Pardon me, Kyo-chan. Oh well. There you go again, sneaking up on me, old man. Oops, I'm sorry, I did it again. Stop calling me Kyocho. It's embarrassing. I was a child. Not going to happen, my dear. You'll always be Kyocho to me. No matter how old you get or how brilliant you become. Ha! How long have you been there? What have you heard? I just got here. Is something wrong? Oh, you have a client. Sorry, sorry. You're going over a case. No, this is. well. Client source, though of a somewhat unconventional nature. Oh, just who are you then? I'm an assistant detective. That's a secret. Well, it's not really a secret. Again, neither of these are good options, but I'm an assistant detective now. Let me introduce you. This is detective Mahayoshi. He's an old friend from when my father ran the agency, and I trust him completely. Oh, he's evil. He's the most elite detective the force has on cybercrime. Looks are deceiving, you were thinking. Well, I suppose I don't exactly fit the mold. But if I did, I'd never be able to tag along with the shady relatives. Oops, step of the tongue. <laughs> So is there anything afoot? It's a case, sit on the sofa and wait a minute. I'll just whip up some tasty coffee. Oh, thank you. There's no case today. No need for coffee. It's very insulted by that. I heard a rumor about Eden's syndrome. Thought you might be interested in Kyo-chan. Let's hear it then. Is this what happened to me? Why don't I get to sit? 
Hmm? This would be very odd. In a meeting. Hmm. <laughs> Just cough a bit. No need to worry about my Cecil man. He's someone with a rather special connection with Eden. Cecil has the potential to become something of a specialist in the field. Let's hear what you have to say. Proceed. You can vouch for your assistant, that's fine. Rumor concerns a special ward in the hospital where they're isolating the Eden syndrome patients. Oh, I need to explain what Eden syndrome is to a future specialist. Refugees from where Eden users suddenly lose consciousness and are unable to wake up. We see more and more patients with each year. Wait, how long has Eden been happening? The cause, symptoms, and treatment remain a mystery. Special reward for Eden patients, treatment, and a search for the cure are underway. Information there is kept heavily restricted. Their facilities, even relatives, can't enter. Rumor there is that they're concealing facts to help protect Kamashiro's image. This means firmly in rumor territory for now. Maybe there have been happenings behind the scenes at Central Hospital. Behind the scenes? Meaning Kamashiro Enterprises, right? Yes, the hospital is under Kamashiro's control. The same Kamashiro runs the Eden Network. Well, they might be the best suited for this. I don't know. The number of patients is increasing. Its symptoms are getting worse. Now of all times is when Kamashiro needs to come clean, not remain silent. An alarming number of people are being admitted to the hospital in question. The security in the special ward has allegedly been beefed up. This means something's afoot. It's going to happen eventually. Yes, indeed. <laughs> I think I'll put some coffee on after all. Toast the agency's success. No one's paying you for this. Oh, look at the time. I'd better get back to the station. Sorry, but let's save the toast for another time. See you later. He just runs out. I watch out for her coffee, especially the color, and the solid chunks floating in it. I fear the day is coming when I'll be forced to actually taste her coffee. That day will be pretty. How do you have chunks in your coffee? What are you doing? It was as he said. There are chunks in the coffee. Fresh info on Eden syndrome is hard to come by. Camera shooters behind the scenes restrictions are doing their job. And security will only get ramped up all the more from out here on out. There's something very strange happening in Eden. And you show up in your weird body and at the same time, Kamashiro's apparently on the move. Is that all merely a coincidence? No, it has to be connected. The rationale is plain as day. No leaves and logic necessary. I'm heading to Central Hospital. I need to get as much info as I can before security is stepped up. I'd be thrilled if you came with me. His face. You might be able to get some info on your current state. Seek and you shall find. Knock and it shall be. No, in your case, let's go with open sesame. Hehe. <laughs> but why? Because I can hack stuff and that's like opening stuff? That seems like a jump in logic. That. Is she. Is she in a skirt? She's got like no pants on. Well, what to do? At times like these, I tend to start off with a frontal attack. Let's try direct negotiations to get us into the hospital's special ward. What else can I do? I'll give you instructions later. Until then, gather info inside the hospital. Asking questions is the most fundamental cornerstone in detective work. I wasn't joking when I said you could become a specialist in the field, my dear prospective assistant. Become a GP and record my activities in a chart. I don't know what a GP is. Or become a boy with shining red cheeks. I, what? It's really a lot of fun. <laughs> I don't know what a GP is. Oh, another animated scene. That girl looks suspicious. The one talking to a nurse. 
Okay, the one who's clearly dead inside. <laughs> and who's just awkwardly posing chest out. Yeah, this is normal. Oh, okay. Are we actually going to talk? Hey, girl! Have we met? Let's just do a... Hello! Nothing? Okay, bye! Nailed it! Alright. Nope, that's not how. So I'm just going to save this. Let's see. Wow, an hour and 40 minutes. Uh, yeah, that was an hour and 40 minutes. Wow. All right. So I'm going to end the stream here. Let's see, because I need to do a stream on YouTube. I'll be playing some Super Smash Brothers. If any of you are interested in watching that, I'll be finishing off some of the World of Light. I beat the boss, final bosses, but there's just some legendary and ace fights I need to take care of. So I'll be going there in like 5-10 minutes for 20 minutes, half an hour. But thank you all so much for watching. There will be more, um, more Digimon Cyber Sleuth coming up. Overall, it's really I'm enjoying it. I love Digimon and this type of game style. Like the, I guess the RPG. Is that what it is? Yeah. It's kind of, yeah, I guess it's an RPG. I don't know. But it's kind of game. I love the style. I love everything about it. So thank you all so much for watching. And I will see you in the next stream. Bye!